Every item has to be modified by hand. It is a lot of work. Boma Mohammed established the non-profit enterprise Royal Renewable Energy Cameroon, or RECAM, three years ago. At its workshop in the capital Yaoundé, they are modifying a portable gas stove. Instead of a gas bottle, it should run on biogas. Some families in the countryside are already using the system. We are doing it, you see, most families they don't use firewood again in their, in their houses. They go by the biogas system or the rubbish in their house. Anything that can get rotten, if they put inside the digester and come out with a good result. You have the cooking gas, you have the, 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 the insecticide that will come out from it, and then you are organic manure. And this is a biogas digester. Boma Mohammed and his team are visiting a village north of Yaoundé to show farmers how to build and operate a biogas system. When the production, the decomposition take place, the gas now will rise and be at the top. They have schooled about 300 people over the past few months. Demand for the devices and training is rising. Still, it is sometimes hard to convince people of the advantages of this new technology. We need that space where it can be practiced and shown to the people because people want to see, people don't want to listen. They've listened a lot and nothing has been happening. So they want to see. So our main aim as practitioners is to carry out lots of experiments and then to show to the people that this thing works. Rekam is installing its biggest facility to date in Akono, a small town outside Yaoundé, with a large septic tank for the recycling of organic waste. It was commissioned by a Catholic seminary there at a cost of about two and a half thousand euros. Human, Kitchen and garden waste will be fed into the tank. The resulting biogas will be used in the seminary kitchen, which feeds the 200 students. Etama Elivet has helped the seminary with the project as a consultant. She had been looking for the right technology for a long time. They even sent me to China to see if I could source the equipment there to produce biogas. Then we discovered that there was already an enterprise in Cameroon itself that makes what we need. So we ordered it through RECAM. RECAM has already installed a number of biogas systems, both portable and fixed. But not many people or institutions in Cameroon are aware of biogas as an eco-friendly energy source. We intend to promote this technology, but you know, with no finance, no materials, no technical or you know, support, it's very, very difficult to create awareness. The government's development plan, Cameroon Vision 2035, aims to promote alternative energies. But so far, the biogas plays a tiny role in the energy mix.